There's a few things we'll need for alignment. The tool is in here. This box, you shouldn't touch the bottom with your bare hands, but the sides are fine. I put it in here, in the hood. Uh, that's where the alignment tool is. The other thing you'll need are all these Allen wrenches. So I will just put them over here now. And we'll need some, some business cards, which I have just to block different, um, uh, different combinations of beams. So let me show you the alignment tool. It's in here. It's essentially a cuvette mounted on a little uh, base. In the cuvette, uh, there's some combination of fluorophores, uh, and there's a plate of metal which has an etching of a sort of a cross uh, with a little pinhole in the middle. Uh, we're going to use that to put light through and make sure that all the sheets in the system are aligned. So let me show it to you a little bit closer, see if this works. You can kind of see it there. I don't know if you can see the hole, but anyway, that's what the cuvette looks like. Uh, so the alignment tool, rather. So um, now we need to put it in this. I always place it the same way, much the same way that I do the, the reservoir. The idea being to keep the alignment consistent, always do it in the same manner. So I put this, I put that um, lid like that. I secure this gently. And our particular cuvette has a, a, a bubble in it. And so I tilt it like this so that the bubble goes and lodges itself kind of in a top corner. We don't want it in the middle of the field of view when we're imaging. Okay, so that looks good. That's what we're shooting for. Now this is gonna go in the system. All right, so I'm gonna grab this. And I'm gonna go down gently. There. So I've tried to put place it as vertically aligned as possible. So now uh, we're actually ready to start the alignment.